Okay, sorry for the kind of uh, crude mock-up graphics here, but I just wanted to make a quick video to show what I've been working on. Um, what this is is a completely emulated virtual DCPU 16, which is a fully programmable 16-bit computer. So what happens is when you press the power button and, and turn it on, uh, it immediately loads whatever's in ROM.bin and starts executing it from address zero. Uh, so it, it performs pretty well so far. Um, this is a 320 by 200 monochrome display. Um, so, but what's a little more interesting is if we turn off the uh, turn off the computer and then we we click this device and then we click a port, you can see the device gets plugged in. And so if we now turn the computer back on, we have some interesting behavior here. And what's happening is the the DCPU is actually sending hardware interrupts to this device that I plugged in and it's turning it on and off. And but what's what's not important is that this is a light. What's important is that this could be any Unity game object could be made into a, a hardware device to get plugged into the computer. Um, so it's extremely extensible and I'm pretty excited because we have a lot of great ideas for, for what to do with this. And uh, so now if I, you can unplug a device by clicking it and then clicking anything that's not a port and that gets unplugged. So I'll, I'll plug all the devices in now, all the lights just to show. Um, Okay, so I, I power it back on, and you can see it, it's sending interrupts to all the devices and turning them on and off. It's just cycling through them, and you can find the uh, the source code for this DASM program on my on my GitHub, along with everything else that you see here. Uh, so stay tuned. We have a lot of ideas. Uh, it's gonna be it's gonna be good. Okay, th thank you.